I should call Tim's. Tim, I found something else. It must be a clue. Turn it over. What does it say? Work hard and be positive. Work hard and be positive. Huh, what do you think that means? I'm not sure, but I like the message of work hard and be positive. Maybe it'll make more sense tomorrow. Hey club friends. So now you know that we're going on an adventure and we have to go to the woods and the jungle to look for clues. But to do that, we need to be equipped with everything we need so we can find the clues that are out there in the woods. So today we are going to make binoculars. What do you need to make your binoculars? You need two toilet paper rolls, a piece of string, some glue, and two paper clips. If you picked up bags at the clubs, these supplies should be in your bags. If you didn't pick up bags at the club, that's okay. These are things that you most likely will have around your house, so you can do the activities with us too. Let's get started. So we are going to start by taking our binoculars and putting a little bit of glue in between them. This is just Elmer's glue. It's in a bottle we had at the club that we use for arts and crafts. And you can see that I am just putting some glue on, okay? If yours is in a squeezy bottle, easy peasy, just squeeze some glue on there. You are then going to stick them together, but they're not gonna stick right away. This is where our paper clips come in handy. Take your paper clip and slide it onto the end there. Okay, and then we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. There we go. This is gonna hold our binoculars together until the glue dries. Now, we need to wear our binoculars when we're out in the jungle, right? So this is where our string comes in handy. If you have a hole punch, I want you to go and make a hole on each side of the binoculars. I don't have a hole punch. Um, so what did I do? What I ended up doing, and if you are at home and need to do this, you need to get mom or dad to help you, okay? I took a tiny little pair of scissors and I poked a hole in my sides. But again, if you have a hole punch, we're gonna use our hole punch as our first option. And our second option is to ask mom or dad for help. Our next step is going to be to thread your yarn through the hole. And then I am just going to do a simple little square knot. We're then gonna take our strip and go to our other hole and do the same exact thing. There we go. Okay, got it through the hole. And this is when you can adjust how long you want your binocular um, just to be. Easy peasy. All right, club friends, I am ready to go on an adventure and search for clues and critters out there in the wild. <gasps> What's that? There's a critter behind me? <gasps> I see a big cat in the jungle. Have fun making your binoculars, have fun finding your critters, and we can't wait to go on this adventure with you this week.